We really, really want to encourage a diverse group of, of visitors to come and experience wilderness, the backcountry, backpacking, hiking, parks in general, nature in general, because that is the makeup of our society. We're a diverse group, black, white, Hispanic, Asian, Native American. There's hundreds of different ethnic groups in America, and we want all of them to enjoy the national parks. And Half Dome is actually a place where you see all of these groups of individuals getting out there to experience it. There's something about that peak that attracts people from all over the world of all types and all ages. This is an extremely long hike. If you're fit, it can take you 10 to 12 hours. If it's your first or second time, 14 hours. You've got to have a turnaround time. Don't say, well, it's almost there, I'm almost there. No, after six, seven hours, if that's your halfway point, turn around. The second thing is water. Water, water, water. Water is the most important thing on this hike. There are water sources along. You should not drink the water because of Giardia and Cryptosporidium. But buy a filter pump, drink, drink, drink. And what upsets me is I see people walking by the water sources and not topping off. You know, folks, water definitely does it. And I just like to help people, give them tips on how to get up here, use hiking poles, bring plenty of water, bring a water filter pump so you're not you know, dehydrated, use gloves to go up those cables. I, I think anybody can do this hike with education, preparation, and motivation. That's all it takes. But I think average person, once they understand what they're in for and they prepare for it and train, to them, their first time, this is massive. You take a look at these cables, first time you see them in person compared to photos or, or movies, man, it's massive, it's 425 vertical feet. You're going two football fields at a 45 degree angle. Hey, that's tough, that's really tough. And so when you get to the top, these people, you know, they, I didn't know I had it in me, that's, that's typical. This is just spectacular. Look at the scenery around here. You got clouds rest on one side, you got El Capitan at the other. This is spectacular. People come from all over the world to do this. We came up here once before, uh, five years ago, when she graduated from high school. That's what she said uh, she wanted the family to do. And uh, we didn't make it all the way to the top that time. Mm -hmm. And uh, it took us five years to come back, but we were bound and determined to do it. And this time we, uh, we went to the top and it was, every, it was worth it. It was worth every bit. The most rewarding thing was making it to the top. I really didn't think I was going to make it. <laughs> it's heart stopping, but it's definitely worth it. Definitely worth the hike. It's a long, long thing. Kills your knees, but when you're up there and you're on top of the world, it's, it's a good feeling to look down over the valley and just see everything. I can't believe that I'm doing this. It was definitely one of the best moments of my life, getting to the top for sure.